Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I appreciate you clicking on that video as always. And we are back with another online haul. Now, I posted in my community tab yesterday that there is this massive sale going on right now on Jerzhov fragrances. Some fantastic prices from what I could see. I checked out the page earlier. I linked it in that community post. And my plan is to grab a Jerzhov fragrance here today. I wasn't planning on doing this video, but when I saw that the sale was going on, I wanted to take advantage of it. Um, I've talked about Jerzhov fragrances on the channel before. May, I've talked about Golden Dollar. I did a first impressions of that. Uh, I did also, uh, I found this in a rack stall hall, this Overture from Jerzhov, and this stuff is beautiful. Um, and I think you can get 100 ml right now for like 142 bucks on Joma Shop. So I'm going to make sure to link it down below uh, and buy something live right now. Now I have a, my eye on a few. If you guys looked at that community post, I do have my eye on a few. 40 knots is one. Um, and there were a couple others. So let's jump into it. I'm going to go on the site. I'm going to pull up Parfumo. I'm going to take a look at the fragrance, take a look at the notes, see if it's something that will work for me. These are complete blind buys. I know that 40 knots gets compared to Ombre Nui from Dior. So I do have a decant of Ombre Nui. I like that scent quite a bit. So, And you guys have been telling me about 40 knots. You said, Gerard, you got to try it. So I'm excited. I, I don't know what it costs right now. Let's pull up the site really quickly um, and go from there. So... We have Joma Shop, and this is now that guys, this deal, this sale is actually only going on till the end of Sunday, which is the 21st. So, if you guys want to grab something, uh, this weekend is the time to do it. Uh, what also what I like is that they are including testers in this deal. So, oh, here's one. Uh, this is the other one I was looking at 1861 Zafiro. I've heard a lot of good things about this one, 110 bucks for. 3.4 ounce, which is insane. Um, Alexandria 2, this is another one that was sort of on my radar. Naxos, uh, Naxos is 200. Uh, you know, I'm going back and forth with Naxos right now. To be honest, you got Herba Pure here. I'm leaning towards 40 knots because my understanding of 40 knots is that it's a very unique scent, and I can get a 3.4 ounce. Of 40 knots for $186. Not sure why the tester is the same price. Uh, I got to go full presentation if that's the case. But $186, the 15% off uh, code FRAG15, that should be applied automatically. So screw it. We're adding this one to the bag right off the bat. And I'm going the big bottle because, you know, 50 ml for 120, uh, that's actually not a bad deal either. Do I go 50 ml or do I go, do I go 100 ml? Um, I mean, to be quite honest, 50 ml is plenty for me. And $125, that's looking pretty good to me right now. Uh, you know what? Since this is a blind buy, I'm going 50 ml, I think. My uh, overture is 100 ml. Guys, this thing, oh man, you know what? Let me uh, let me pull this up quick. My wife, there's not a lot that she considers to be sexy in terms of fragrances. Seriously, there's a handful of my fragrances that she has actually used the word sexy on. This is one of them. She absolutely melts when I have this on. It has this creamy herbal tea-like quality. It has orange in here, um, sandalwood, cinnamon, a little bit of vanilla, incense. Beautiful scent. This is super addictive. I'm actually going to wear this out Saturday night. Uh, it's Friday at the time of filming this. I'm wearing this out tomorrow night. I'm supposed to be going to a friend's 40th birthday party. Uh, I think it's going to be perfect. A little warm out tomorrow night. We're going to a brewery, uh, a bunch of guys. So I am definitely, definitely going to be wearing Overture from Zhirzhov. And as I said, fantastic deal going on right now. I do like the 100 ml bottle. I think nice hefty bottle. It's it's heavy. Uh feels really nice in the hand. But I don't know. I you know what? I think I'm going to save the dough 
Maybe I'll get two. So let's take a look. Let's do the 1.7 uh, for 125, which for me, the awesome deal. Um, let's add that to bag. Okay. Normally 178.99. So just save 75 bucks. So let's let's uh, close that out and let's see here. Uh, oh, sorry. Let me switch back here. Okay. So we added that to bag. <clears throat> and let's do this. All right. So let's go back. I, you know, let's, if you guys want to look, yeah, you know what? Let's look at 40 knots really quick. But as I said, what I know, what little I know about this scent, you guys have talked about this scent. Uh, I mean, many videos that I've done in the comments, someone has said, you got to try 40 knots. What do you think of 40 knots? So the main accord is a woody, spicy, sweet, aquatic, and fresh. You have honey, seawater, woody notes, and sea breeze. Now, <clears throat> that sounds amazing. Um, as I said, you know, they don't do it on Parfumo, but it does get compared to, oh, similar. Okay. Ombre Nui. So yeah. So it gets compared to Ombre Nui, which I love. I really like that fragrance. I had considered buying that fragrance. So, uh, yeah, let's, let's go here really quickly. All right. All right uh, let's go back. See what else we got. So Naxos, I was considering adding that to the collection. I have a really good dupe of Naxos, guys, from Barrett Fragrances, and I've talked about them on the channel before. If you have not checked out Barrett, go check them out. I do not have a discount code for them at the moment. Um, I'm hoping to talk to the owner. I don't know. At one point, they were giving out discount codes, and then they got away from it. So I want to check in with him and see, but they have some fantastic inspired by fragrances and i have one from them called honeyfields which is a naxos clone it's incredible so uh more than words is one that has been on my radar for a bit that's a really good price as i mentioned before uh 1861 by uh 1861 zafiro it's an edp let's take a look at that one um i don't know i just heard this one talked about as being sort of a sleeper from the house so let's take a look. So main accords are spicy, smoky, resinous, woody, and oriental. Top notes are bergamot, davana, elemi resin, wine. Mid notes are cardamom, carnation, cinnamon, iris. Base notes, frankincense, amber, honey, and ooh. So, so that's not a scent. It's creamy. This is liquid. Surge. I'm always confused by some of these descriptions and uh Arfumo, they're like, I don't know. It's like, it, it's almost like it, someone was typing in a different language and it translated for them. Uh, incense as well. I'll question the central note around which all the others have been added. So it's an incense note. Okay. Like this stuff, the life giving sun. You can see nothing greater than the city of Rome. Interesting quote. Okay. Good autumn blues therapy. Zafiro is a meditation in a bottle. Incense here is almost only a breath. Through it is the scent appears to me almost ethereal. Amber spices and resins give it a woody sweet touch. Thus the fragrance is resinous, only a hint of sweet woody. It is like an autumn blues therapy. The scent conveys peace, security, unity with autumn nature. It fits more into the gray autumn days as I see this perfume more on the men than on the women, although it is quite unisex. The durability and the sillage are great and the bottle is beautiful. Okay. Well, Let's see what else we got. Um, Alexandria 2, as I said, that one is beloved by many. Um, get the what looks like the full prez here. Um, here's the Overture 14720, guys. Absolute steal for that. Such a good scent. Beautiful scent. Can't wait to wear that one tomorrow. Um, Shooting Stars, Cosmo 1888. I know some people like this one quite a bit. That one is 151.89. Let's let's see. Cosmo 1880. Let's see what it says about that. Okay. 
I mean, accord is a spicy, floral, oriental, sweet, and woody carnation. So I'm always hesitant when I see florals in the top notes uh, because they, for me, uh, and Indonesian lang lang, so yellow floral, you know, they tend, those tend to lean feminine for me. Uh, those are kind of a question mark basically for me. So I'm going to skip that one just based on the notes. And guys, this is kind of my thing when I'm doing like blind buying. It's not a perfect science. I'm just going in. I am very familiar with notes at this point, which ones I like, which ones I don't, which combinations I like and which I don't. However, you are sort of putting all your eggs in one basket by using sites like Parfumo and Fragrant uh, Fragrantica to determine that because they're not always correct. So um, I do the best I can to identify notes through the manufacturer, through the actual the house themselves. But even they are limited to what they are posting nowadays. Sometimes they don't list any notes. Sometimes they only list three. So it's really what you what you get from it. Uh, but in terms of blind buying, you can only do so much homework. So, but there is a fun aspect to blind buying as well. Let's see. Sorry. Okay, let's go back to this. So Golden Dollar, I really like that one. So I was testing, uh, not testing, but I had um, Overture on one hand and Golden Dollar on the other. By far and away, everyone I asked, they preferred Overture over Golden Dollar. Now, Golden Dollar is supposed to have a coffee note, a pretty substantial coffee note. I get zero coffee from it. I get no coffee at all. Um, to me, it's just more of sort of a sweet, powdery, um, maybe some labdanum in there. It just, it's a good scent. I like it, but it's just not what I was expecting. I was expecting coffee, which is why I got the sample of it. Um, so we got two pages worth of stuff here. I'm, I'm, do I go Naxos? I don't know. Uh, Mephisto. Now Mephisto is one 80 bucks for a one ounce. Yeah. I wouldn't even bother with the one ounce though. More than words. Oh, here's Mephisto. This is the 3.4 ounce. So let's check. You know what? Let's check Mephisto. I know some of you guys like Mephisto. Casamirati, which is Zerjoff. It's just a line from Zerjoff. So you got citrus, fresh, floral, green, spicy. So it seems like a nice summer scent. Bergamot, grapefruit, lavender. Uh, 8.1 out of 10. Or uh, iris, interesting. I like the uh, I like iris in the mid here. It's, uh, I would imagine you probably get some iris from this scent. Uh, under undefined figure without personality. Great opening with citrus. Then for me, more comparable to Creed Himalaya. Ooh, well, don't want to replace my Creed Himalaya. You guys know I love Himalaya. I just did a video this week on Himalaya. Um, yeah, and in an effort to not be redundant, it looks like it gets compared to Silver Mountain Water, which some people compare Himalaya to. There's qualities of Himalaya uh, and Silver Mountain Water that are shared with the Creed DNA. All right, so you know what? I don't know. I feel like I should be grabbing another one. Go. So, hmm. Should I grab guys? Do I do I take my chances and try Zafiro? 110 bucks for a tester. I'm doing it. Do I do the tester? I don't know if it comes with a cap. It's the only thing. Um Alexandria too. I mean this this stuff is Ricey, 326, and that's after the code. So usually it's, let's see. I mean, how good is this stuff? 227.95 for a tester. So not cheap. Um, but people love this one. You know what? I'm going to go. I'm, I don't own any Casamirati. So this this would be my first. I think I'm gonna do that. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna go Casamirati 1881. I'm sorry, 1861. 
tester for $110. So yes, it's a blind buy. I'm spending over a hundred bucks, but I'm getting a 3.4 ounce bottle of Zafiro, which people seem to like this one. I'm adding to cart. So my my total is going to be 235.14. Here you can see the frag 15 is applied. So the additional discount on top of that, orders over 100 are automatically eligible for free shipping. So guys, just to wrap it up, uh, I think that you should definitely take advantage of this. I am going to link it down below. Um, and if nothing else, this for me, I would consider a safe blind buy. It's such an interesting scent. It's unique. It is, as I said, a creamy cinnamon orange tea, like a tea with milk, a little bit of sweetness, unisex fragrance. So both men and women can wear this. However, I do think this leans a little more masculine. Um, it, it's powerful. This lasts forever. Oh, it's so good. I can't wait to wear this tomorrow. So guys, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys end up grabbing if you take advantage of the sale this weekend. Drop it in the comments. What did you see that I should have grabbed? Maybe you shouldn't put that so I'm not kicking my... I'm going to post this tomorrow. Put in the comments what you think I should grab. If I have to, I'll jump back on and grab another bottle. I love it. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting this channel. I am doing a 5,000 subscriber giveaway soon. I'm apo I apologize ahead of time for the delay on that, but I will be doing a 5K giveaway. We're almost at 6K. So if, you, if you're not subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe so you can jump in on the 5K giveaway and then the soon to be 6K giveaway. So thank you guys so much. I hope you have a fantastic day. If you like this video, please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share. And I will see you guys on Monday with my weekly wares video. Thanks.